This park is just minutes from St. Cloud, so if you live in that area or are passing through St. Cloud area, then this is a great place to come and check out. I am at St. Cloud Quarry Park right now. This is a park that used to be a granite mine, and now it's turned back into like a natural setting, but there are remnants of the mine with these big quarries where granite was dug out a long time ago. I'm going to go hiking here today and show you how cool this place is. So we are right here and my plan is to go this way and kind of do a big loop around. Two of the quarries here at this park are designated for swimming and growing up I went swimming at the quarries a few times with friends but I never took the time to go hiking or check out the rest of the park. There's also a few spots where you can do some trout fishing. You can also go scuba diving at designated areas, rock climbing at designated areas. In the winter time there's cross country skiing here and online it said that these trails are easy enough for beginners which it seems like it would be because it's pretty level here. It's also just gorgeous and I'm imagining here in a couple weeks the colors would be incredible here. There are no lifeguards so if you come here to swim be aware that it is dangerous, there are sheer drop-offs, and there are some places where there are rocks underwater. So if you're going to be jumping off of the drop-offs, or jumping off of those cliffs, you want to be aware that it's not necessarily um, deep enough in every area to do that. Wow. This is so cool. I don't really know why this is here, if it's just here to check out, but there are more slabs over here in the woods as well, just off of this main trail. For those who are unfamiliar with what bouldering is, it's like rock climbing, but on legit rocks instead of like mountain sides or cliffs and I'm not sure what this is going to look like but I'm going to follow this trail and go check out what the bouldering here at this park looks like. Don't get offended if you're a boulderer and I didn't explain it well. I've never been, I've just had friends who did. I apologize in advance for my bouldering ignorance. It's for people with strong arms and legs, that's for sure. Oh this is cool. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh my gosh. Wow. Man, if this isn't just an incredible spot to sit down and read a book, I don't know what is. So maybe that's a bouldering area, but it looks like you'd get wet. There's also a lot of rocks over here, but it just seems like you wouldn't want to climb this. Like, what if things fell? I don't know. I guess I don't know anything about this. Really. Ow. But this looks like remnants of when they were mining in here. They just stacked this all up and left it like that. I'm imagining all of this rock was dug out of here picnic table and a squirrel squirrel's gone well i don't know where this goes we're just back to the main trail it looks like well that was fun even if you're not a boulderer i would suggest checking out the bouldering area i would not have done that if it weren't for wanting to show you so thank you Wow, it's so pretty out here. I think I'm coming up on the boardwalk. There's a boardwalk here at this park that goes across a little boggy area. Right now it's really dry because it's so dry this year, but it's still cool, it's pretty.
there's seriously a deer right there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I hope I can grab this without ruining the moment. There's a deer right there. Oh my gosh. My heart is beating so fast. It looks farther away. Oh my gosh, there's two deers. Oh my gosh. That was so cool. Oh my gosh. I was like doing this filming thing, getting myself walking. And I didn't think I'd even be able to show you because the GoPro was on the ground ahead of me. That was so cool. Well, that was so cool and they look farther away on this camera because it's a wide angle lens but really those deer were like 20 30 feet away from me that was really really cool oh my gosh oh, i love it here <laughs> To be honest, I don't have any specific intention on where to go or what to show you in this video. I'm just going to check out the park and bring you along with. I don't know where this path that I'm on right now is going. The sign it looks like says that you can do some trout fishing up here. This is gorgeous. The water is incredibly green though. Incredibly green. Like a fake looking nasty green. But it's so peaceful. I always wonder how deep these are. Because I know some of the swimming areas are over 100 feet deep. But I don't know about this spot here. And I don't want to know because I don't want to get in this green water. But it's something I think about. I wonder how deep it is. Or how many things are at the bottom of these quarries. Like garbage or lost things fishing hooks and the sign says you can do trout fishing here but they must stock this with trout I can't imagine them naturally surviving here I don't know anything about how trout live but this one's kind of gross other ones aren't this gross I promise I'll show you pretty ones that are not green some of the leaves are beginning to change colors already so this is quarry number two, and this quarry fills up completely full of people oftentimes in the summer because there are places where you can jump off, but you've kind of got to know what you're doing because you never know when there are going to be rocks underneath the water. But in some places, this quarry is, I believe this one's over 100 feet deep in some places. The water right now looks kind of green, but I've swam here before and it was lovely. And there's a little dock as well. What a cool place to get to hang out so close to home. So pretty too. Oh my gosh, these leaves are just gorgeous. Wow. The overlook is a place where you walk up this little path that goes up and up in elevation until you get to the top where there's this little kind of viewing deck to look out over the little meadowy area. But check this out. It's nice and breezy up here. So 
that feels really good after walking up that steeper part and I booked it up here because I don't know I guess I was just in a rush this is the natural water level so what's going on I don't get it also there are basketballs footballs garbage lots of stuff in there which is really sad really really sad There is a bathroom right next to quarry number 11. Oh, this is so pretty. This is your reminder to hit the like button and subscribe. It means a lot to me and it really helps out my channel.